Today, we will briefly go over pyogenic flexor tenosynovitis. This occurs secondary to an infection of the flexor tendon sheets within the hand. You might hear this also referred to as septic or suppurative flexor tenosynovitis and is definitely something you could see in the emergency department on rotation. This closed space infection can lead to acute findings that are called cannibal signs, which you should definitely know and be able to rattle off to your resident. The cannibal signs are pain to percussion or palpation of the finger. The finger will rest in a passive flexion and thus will have pain with passive extension. And finally, the finger is a so-called sausage digit with swelling along the length of the finger. The most common bug to cause PFT is Staphylococcus aureus and can occur secondary to a fight bite injury or other traumatic wounds that can introduce bacteria to the site. PFT is commonly treated with immediate antibiotics, namely vancomycin or ceftriaxone. However, antibiotic choice may vary depending on current standards, cultures, and mechanism of injury. Irrigation and debridement is also commonly performed, but amputation may also be necessary depending on the severity.